we get started, this tournament is under the supervision and regulation of the Games and Amusement Board. Maapag sweep ba ang Happy Feet Emperors or will signal Ultra Warriors Force a game number three? Here we go. Three in the mid here for Happy Feet Emperors. Ibisitahin ni uh, Japes ang uh, mga buff. Check niya. Oh, ano nangyayari dyan? Mm -hmm. Oh, nanggugulo lang. Kalid na naman ang nakikita natin dito na makakapagbigay lang din ng pressure against Janos, against iba DJ. Pero ang ganda ng ginagawa dito ni iba DJ para lang ma-zone out din dito si Japes dahil kahit pa paano may stun din pa rin naman yung Farsa na ito na nga low on health makagad si Kalid. Mapapa-disengage siya at nasayang na din yung oras nga na nabuo doon dahil nakakuha dito ng sure buff si Janus and makakakuha din ng time dito ang Signal Ultra Warriors. Makuha pa yung kanila mga resources dito sa kanilang jungle site. Mm -hmm. I think it's key as well for Emperors, no? Na protektahan din si Chichi. Kasi nga, kapag nakuha na ng purple tong link na ito, early on, like kunyari, at least ito, masaya siya kasi naka-buff siya agad. Pero mamaya-maya, mga mid-game, after the second rotation, after the second wave of uh, jungle creeps, baka doon na masaktan, doon na mahirapan. And look, so far, lamang si Chichi si XP, ha? Mm, ito ang maganda for the side of Emperors. Alam nila na saan yung pwede nilang, yung pwede na ma nilang maging limit pagdating sa mga pag invade And ito na nga yung ginagawa nila. They are giving Chichi enough time and pressure para lang makapagpuha lang din ng mga kills. Pero on to the top lane, they go, there goes down Japes into the hands of Signal Ultra Warriors. Mm, big rotations from the Warriors. Apat ang pumunta doon. And... Yeah, that's fine. It's 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 uh, something that will happen to Jape a lot, lalo na uh, hindi pa siya ganong kaunat, and it, it's not under good circumstances. So that's something that the emperors had to learn the hard way, no? But real quick, mommy, laban sila dito, Jape. Still on, wala pang ult. Tapos sa bukod dito ng Orn Rose, in comes Chiki from the backline show. Medyo nanganib. Oh, that's going to be the uh, order brilliance to save him. Chujin, hindi pa nag-cool down ang Falling Star Moon. That's gonna be a disengage. Skirmish lang. Magulo. Mm -hmm. Dito sa may uh, turtle. 20 seconds away. Ang maganda dito for the side of Happy Feet Emperors. Well, hindi sila gaano na pa uwi ng uh, Signal Ultra Warriors after that skirmish, after that fight. When it comes to rotation, dito kasi lalamang talaga yung Happy Feet Emperors dahil more on na makapag-rotate sila, makapulisita sa mga side laners. Doon natin makikita na mabilis yung gold advantage nila against Signal Ultra Warriors. Mm -hmm. Reggie here. Oh, gonna go for the ult. Oh, gonna survive. Janus taken out though. Si Shaw. Tapalas coming in, rotating from top. And now in mid, Chichi binibait out. Si Imba DJ nagahanap. Rhea, ingat. Meron siyang full combo dito. Feather Dare Strike zoning them out. Imba DJ, second game in a row na naka-fire sa. Tingnan natin kung maganda ang hulog niya dito. Tapes, wala pa rin. Rampaging Sandstorm. Are they gonna go for this turtle? Bukang hindi pa. Hmm, hindi pa muna dahil alam nila na hindi pa ito yung tamang oras. Maganda dito for Happy Fit Emperors. Nakukuha na nila yung tempo, yes. And na nakukuha na nila, nila yung patience pagdating sa mga pinipili nilang sa mga pinipili nilang mga clash against Signal Ultra Warriors. And I have to say na ang ganda ng ginagawang ito for the side of Happy Fit Emperors dahil na open up nila yung space for Chichi, na open up nila yung space for the objectives na makuha pa ng the rest of the teams nila. Oh, another big fight breaks out. As they get the turtle, Chi-Chi secures it. Papabagsakin dito si Ben Sanity. At boy pa, si Kyle. Muntik na yun si Kyle. Nagbagsak lang ng Revitalize. Oh, nice Tempest of Blades to save him. Reggie gets some lifesteal. Goes behind enemy lines. Dito siya ngayon. Hinahabol ni Chujin. Falling Star Moon. Oh, gagamitin ang Cyclone Eye to Mamba out. And then rotate into attacking the Outer Turret Energy Shield. So far, so good for the Emperors, mm -hmm. though still behind, about 500. Buhay na buhay dito ang dugo ng Happy Fit Emperors para lang makalamang na makalamang against Signal Ultra Warriors. And nakikita natin ngayon, Signal Ultra Warriors, hindi nagaanong malalim yung pinupush through nila against Happy Fit Emperors. Hinahanap na lang nila yung chance para makakuha ng kill. Hinahanap nila kung sino yung nagiging, yung sino nagiging uh, sino na left out pagdating sa rotation na ginagawa ng Emperors. Katulad na lang dito, onto the top lane, mukhang nanganganib mm -hmm. na si Lunox. Oh no, Shaw, nahuli ng Hurricane Dance at hindi na apag order of Brilliant Japes. Medyo nahuli rin sa pag-trigger ng Rampaging Sandstorm. A free kill for the Warriors, putting them up to now about a thousand gold. But, Imba DJ mapapasama dito sa mid. Rhea, a little too late to join the party, could not save his support, his team captain. Pero ang story ay nasakas pa rin. Pinapressure dito ng Warriors, si Japes, as they retreat. Wow, honey glaze, so far nagsasagutan na sila. This is better than game one. 
Yes, and ito nga yung nasabi natin kanina, Signal Ultra Wars, alamin mo na nila kung sino yung dapat nilang i-pick off. Katulad na lang nung nasa top lane, they went in for the Lunox, and doon natin nakita na pwede pa rin kumuha dito ng tempo, pwede pa rin kumuha dito ng momentum ang side ng Warriors dahil every kill counts against Signal Ultra at nakikita natin na hindi na rin pwedeng magpasabasa dito ng rotation na ang Emperors dahil Kapalit nun is another objective for the side of Signal Ultra Warriors and mawawala ng chance dito, Happy Fit Emperors, na makakuha ng 2-0 against the Warriors. Mm, ito yung sabi ko eh, na it doesn't matter much, I mean, scores-wise, it's mm. just Signal Ultra Warriors will play their best. Ganun sila akalmado. As in, sige, nandito na tayo, we're gonna try to win. Now, Kyle wants to go for it. Oh, hindi niya pa rin makukuha. Ben Sanity, Hurricane Dance, palayo. Mabubuhay pa din si Kyle. Oh, in comes James and Reggie. Pero hindi nila pipilitin. Dito lang sila. Nag-aantay sa baba si Rhea. Abantay kay Chichi. Will they go for the turtle this time? I think they can. This is a 4v4. Malayo si Tsujin. Mm -hmm. Kulang pa sila ng tao dito. But there goes the, uh, the retribution for the link. Pero sumagot naman dito ng Feathered Air Strike. Yung parsa Chichi will be cornered. But we have the Jitong Do Way of the Dragon. Airborne na dito si Kadita. And we'll not be using that rough waves para lang makakuha ng kill. But still, Chichi is on the move just to get a triple kill. Mamaminyak niya pa nga yata ito. Kaso disengage niya lang muna. Sagot dito na Happy Fit Emperors. It's a 3-2 exchange in favor of the Emperors dahil ang ganda na naging rotation nila, ang ganda na nakuha nila nila. Yung kills na yun together with that turtle. But on the other hand, Imba DJ naman nakaganti rin kahit papaano kay Japes. Kala ni Japes, kaya niya na eh. No? Nag-quick sound guard siya pero nabitin pa pala ng isang blast. May laman pa yung feathered airstrike. Right now, a mirror delayed if ever from Chichi taken down bottom lane. Ito ulit, panawarin natin yung team fight na yon habang nagre-recover ang dalawang teams. Nagsimula siya with a pick off up top by Chujin and then down bottom, mina, 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 minagulang dito ni uh, Chichi ang uh, buong kumpunan ng Warriors. Nasabi mo nga muntik pang mag main -yak. Pero sabi niya, hindi, sige, huwag natin pinitin itong kay uh, Imba DJ kasi baka ako masasama. Hindi nasa ilang tentore. But because of that, sabi ni Imba DJ, that's your first mistake. Right now, nag-abula naman sila dito. Kyle pops the poisons, pushing away Janos and Sujin. Minsan, sabi niya, guys, out muna tayo. We cannot engage. As these teams find more ways to engage. This is one of the disadvantage when you have the Akai. One... Uh, one mombo combo lang kasi yung pwede niyang gawin with a thousand pounder and the hurricane dance but still yung advantages na naman din na yun mapipigilan niya rin yung pag-engage ng members dito ng Happy Fit Emperors and maganda yun dahil pick off after pick off ang pwede rin gawin ng ha Signal Ultra Warriors against Happy Fit and malaking bagay na rin yun for Signal Ultra dahil every every kill gives, gives them an opportunity oh, makuha ang din yung winning condition nila at kailangan din din man nila na bigyan pa dito si Imba DJ ng space at ng time makapag-recover, makakuha din ng kanyang oh, kindness. As you say okay. that, nice pick off down bottom onto Tsujin. The Esmeralda cannot farm anymore. Hurricane Dance dito nagamit na ni Ben Santi. Siyang papasabugi oh. dito ni Chichi. Too late, they pop the feathered airstrike gonna convert straight from that 2-0 into the turtle pero mukhang huli na. Oy, kaya pa pala. 10 seconds left here for the turtle. Hindi pa siya naging lord. That's gonna be all turtles, I think, going over to the emperors. Right now, habulis Janos. Tempest of Blade sa ilalim ng tore. Uy, galing. I-frames, ladies and gentlemen. I-frames used here by Janos to survive. Grabe, sabi niya, tama na, Chichi. Grabe, kanina pa naman. 5-0 pa rin ang link na ito. Oh man, Chichi, haabangan ko talaga dito. Kung ano man ang maging future dito ni Chichi sa ano, sa league natin na ito. Dahil ibang klase talaga dito yung galawan ni Chichi throughout the game. Nandun yung patience niya, nandun din yung responsibility niya para lang i-pick off yung burst damage dealers dito ng side ng Signal Ultra Warriors. And dito na rin nahihirapan ang Signal Ultra dahil anytime, anywhere, pwedeng pumasok dito si Chichi. Wala silang pampigils kay Chichi dahil nakikita natin onto the top lane. Rhea, medyo hands full na siya dito onto the top lane para lang i-clear out yung minion waves. Yep, hold up now. Napasabugan oh. dito. Oh, wait! Nice turnaround! Kala ko muntik na si Ben Sanity pero si Imba DJ pa na may tinatago. Meron siyang dynamite! And that's gonna be two for none here. Reggie and Shaw taken out just like that. Now, the tables seem to have turned, honey glaze. Parang mm. yung engagements nasa side ng Warriors, parang kinasabi nila, hindi, tayo ang magsasabi, tayo pipili. Mm. DJ, ikaw magsabi kung kailan. And so far, gumagana itong uh, hatid strategy nila na parang 
either si Rhea or si Bensanity magsabi kung kailan lalaban. And then they do it. Now they pick off Kyle. Easy. Hmm. Ang sarap ng kill na yun for the side of Signal Ultra but still Chichi against Rhea naman ang nagkatapat dito onto the top lane. Hinabol niya pa rin with the pinch voice. Rhea is go, eh, might go down dahil nakatapat niya pa rin dito si Khaled. Uuwi na, makakauwi pa nga ba dito si Rhea dahil dalawa nakakatapat niya against Emperors but still ang ganti naman dito ng Signal Ultra. Sige, kuhanin mo Rhea yung attention nila. Inner turret will be into the hands of Signal Ultra Wars onto the bottom lane. Yep, di nila kaya si Rhea. I mean, so much mobility on that show. And yes, nagamit niya na yung flicker. And medyo ubus yata yung energy ni uh, Chichi doon. Kaya hindi nila sasayangan ng oras. That really would have been what Signal Ultra Warriors wanted anyway. Right now, si Ben Sanity, nagahabol dito, still wants to pin down Japes. And just like uh, Rhea, no, ito rin. Medyo malito kung pipilitin yung kalabanin si Japes. Now, Chichi and uh, Reggie wants to find a uh, fight here. Kumu position sa baba, sagutin muna ni Chichi si Rhea once more, round 2, here we go, Tempest of Blades, nasagot na, in comes Kyle, misses the stun, oh, he's gonna get it, one more, oy boy pa, there you go, finally, taken out, monster kill, wala pa rin patay, dito, para sa Warriors to take down Chichi, 6 and 0, oh. we'll see how far they can take this, ang ganda ng positioning ng Warriors ha, they have good map control, they're forcing it to be blue as much as possible. Mm, pero another skirmish might happen dahil sinisimula na nga dito ang Happy Vet Emperors, yung first level lord and opportunity na naman yun sa kanila dahil kulang ng isa ang warriors dito and they might possibly won't be able to steal this lord dahil meron, meron pa naman dito ang um, retribution for Chichi and there goes another and another zone from the side of Kadita dahil hindi na si Farsa dito makapagbigay lang ng kanya feathered air strike Ooh, mukhang all-in. Tempest of Blades here gonna be used. Mm. Chichi secures the Lord. And Vinsanity is gonna go down. So does Janus. Ladies and gentlemen, currently a 2-0 ang trade dito ng Emperors. Lamang sila versus the Warriors. Now, Sujin running away. Dave's gonna try to force this. Baka siya pa ang mapasama. And that's gonna be true. Baka DJ to taking him out. That's two for one. The winning condition for the side of Emperors dito. Ang laki na ng binibigay nila. Ang laki na ng pwede nila dito kuhanin. Again, Signal Ultra Wars. And again, this might be it for uh, for Signal Ultra dahil nawawala na sila ng chance na makuha pa at ma-defend pa yung kanilang base. Kapag binigyan pa nila din dito si Chichi ng opportunity, it take down dito si Esmeralda Arder or Farsa onto that bottom team. Pero Rhea, sobrang mali ang nakita natin galawan dito dahil napatay siya kagad with the one hit delete from Reggie. Reggie gets another kill against Rhea. And that's what's scary about Reggie, no? Uh, again, there's a reason why Kadita, ladies and gentlemen, has been, been picked up more often now. It's because of how uh, the hero can engage, can go in, have a solid amount of CC and survive dahil may lifesteal siya paglabas niya. And right now, mukhang mapapasama dito si Kyle kahit na naapoy sans ka, kapatid. Marami yan, apat yan, huwag mong pilitin. Huwag kang makulit, now another Ooh. one. Reggie goes down, Tujin gets the kill. They're gonna force it onto Tujin. No, kulang na sila, Emperor, tatlo na lang. Lahat sila nasa mid. Kulang ang kanilang firepower para mapilit ang push na ito. They're gonna disengage and just pressure the rest of the map. So far, so good for the Warriors still. Wala namang 2,000 ang lead mm -hmm. ng Emperors and hindi pa sila butas. Ito ang mga errors na kailangan bantayan ng Signal Ultra dahil more o, mer, more errors na magawa dito ang eh, Happy Fit Emperors, more opportunity for them to get back into the lead dahil 2K lang naman na nilalaman dito ng, ng Happy Fit Emperors at hindi na rin nalalayo ito dahil ilang beses na rin dito nakakuha ng kill si Janos, ilang beses na rin dito nakaporma si Chujin para lang makakuha ng kill against Emperors but still, yung chances kasi dito ng Happy Fit Emperors para mapigilan yung Signal Ultra Warriors. They have the Khalid, they also have the burst damage from the Lunox and from the Kadita dahil ang laki ng opportunity nila kumuha ng kill with the Parsa na ganito lang yung gagawin niya, Feather Air Strike just to zone out Happy Fit Emperors with that incoming flash. Mm -hmm. So far, Signal Ultra Warriors made the most of the absence of the two members of the Emperors. Tira mo, mm -hmm. ano Glaze? Blue na yung mapa. Ano nila na napush na nila? And again, this is no uh, small contribution, not, not in any small contribution to the rest of the team. No, hindi lang yan si Imba DJ, hindi lang yan si Janus. Maganda ang uh, ginagawa rin ni Rhea Chani Bensanity. Action Jackson sila. Never sila nagsistay sa isang lane. Parati lang sasamahan yung team. Parati nilang hahanapan ng magandang butas ang Emperors para mapag-engage. And so far, Minsan nga si Rhea magpupumulit pang mag 2v1 eh. Pero kaya niya naman, nabubuhay naman siya most times. Mm -hmm. Dahil Chu is still a Chu na pwede rin makapag in and out. At nakita natin yung pagbabay time niya, pagbabait niya dito with the Khaled and with Chi Chi doon sa top lane kanina. Doon mm -hmm. nakakuha mm -hmm. din ng opportunity at 
ng space pa ang Signal Ultra Wars to get another objective dahil ang laki ng objective na yon inner turret, kapalit ng hindi mo napatay na choose. So, ang laking chance pa rin dito for the side of Signal Ultra Wars na makuha pa rin, um, makuha pa rin yung tempo nila against Happy Feet Emperors. Exactly. And I think Emperors are also kind of struggling. Nahirap pa sila mag-push dito kasi alam nila na kapag tayo nagpo-push, kapag tayo nandito, the rest of the warriors are elsewhere. So lugi tayo. May mga configurations kasi yung team ng Emperors na kulang sila ng firepower. That's what you get when you have two tanks. Diba? Ika nga, you have the Khalid and you have the, ba the Baksha. Side lane Baksha. Kaya minsan hindi ko trip yung side lane Baksha is because kahit side laner siya, hindi siya yung parang thumbs or lapu-lapu na parang may surprising amount of damage. So that's what's lacking on the side of the Emperors. Whenever they pick fights, it has to be a good fight for them. Kasi kung hindi, wash lang yun. Malinis lang. Now second Lord up. Yes, and I like what you said na hindi talaga maganda kapag naging side lane dito si Baksha dahil ang kulang sa damage, kulang din sa stuns and kulang din sa pag-sustain but there goes there goes down the Baksha dahil tatlo ang umaabansi talaga sa kanya pero on to that Lord Pit naman gumagawa na rin dito ng paraan para mas still ito na Signal Ultra Warriors against Emperors. Oh, was it worth it? Ginula lang pala nila yun. Apat dito sa my Lord. Ben Sanity gonna get hit here. Popping the immortality. Lord still secured by Chi Chi. Si James dito, Papa Sabugen. Oh, mabubuhay pa. Yung mga DJ na apag. Oh, napag uh, Feathered Airstrike na. Tapos gimmick time with the blades out. May immortality pa rin. Show. Oh, nice use of the Winter Truncheon. Isa na lang. That's gonna be one of four. Show. Kaya naman ang nag-Winter Truncheon. Oh, no way of the Dragon by Rhea. Here comes the cavalry. That's gonna be Order of Brilliance. Lumalaban pa. Rhea still alive. Show. Oh, two! That's gonna be two surviving members for Signal Ooh. Ultra Warriors. Make that one! Si Raya na lang ang natitira. May Lord na nagmamarcha sa may top lane. That's gonna be the Luminous Lord. Chichi here picks up the Malefic Roar. He says it's clobbering time. So mga Torin to, babagsak na. Honey Glaze, can you feel it? Might this be it? This might really be it dahil ang laki pa nang iniday nating death timers for the members of Signal Ultra Warriors. Ito na nga na naman yung Depths of Blades. Simagot naman dito with the sure 